when I listen to what all the news people are saying about the climate in this country and the division in this country between um, basically the haves and the have-nots, the people who have forgotten about government's role and, and that is to serve all of the people and not just some of the people. And it has, and, and it's, it's really shown itself here in this state in um, this recent budget that was passed. And uh, the horrible cuts that were made that affect the people most in need, that, that affect the people who most benefit from the services that government can provide when they can't provide for themselves. And really, the education issue sort of ties it all together because, you know, you, you, you need good schools, you need public schools that are open and accessible to everyone, free and open and accessible to everyone, not just for those who don't have disabilities, not just for those who don't have uh, language barriers, but to everyone. And, and good students, quality education begins, begins with quality prenatal care begins with quality well child care, begins with um, the people's ability to put food on the table and a roof over their heads and clothes on their children's back. And those are all things that, um, that we as progressive people standing here today are fighting against. You know, we, we're fighting against the forces that are cutting those things. And um, it's, we have to do this. We have to stand up. We have to stand together. We have to do this together. We have to stand together. And I know that my running mates and I are, we're already out there. We're already doing it. Um, we are just so thrilled to be doing it and, and talking to people and listening to what they have to say and the anger, the anger that people are just spewing at us. Sometimes people say to me, Oh, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And I say, no, I'm glad that I can, I can listen to you. This is what I'm here to do, is listen to you. Um, and they're not happy. So we have to make sure that we get this engine that drives this state, the middle class, fired up, ready to run, ready to go in November. We've got to get everybody out to the polls because, as several people have said, this is going to be a low voter turnout. And we've got to make sure because every vote is going to count in November. And we've got to make it count.